media queries can be used along with template areas to make responsive layouts. Let's look at the page right now. See, when I change the size, it will change how things are laid out on the screen with the header, the advert, the content. So you can see how that works here. Here is the default. The default one is right here, with, and the default would be in the smallest size. However, we also have this media query. When the min width is 300 pixels, so when it's over 300 pixels, we're going to change the template. So you'll see here, there's just four areas, header, advert, content, footer. Here, each row has the advert on the side and then either has the header, the content, or footer. You can see that when you change the size of the, the, the window size. Let's do one more. To solve this challenge, when the min width is 400 pixels, we want the header to be along the all the top. So I'm going to put header, I'm going to change the word advert to header, and we want the footer to be along the full bottom at min width 400 pixels. So I'm going to put footer here. And now if I refresh, we'll see that there's three different sizes we can do. So here you can see the header on the top and bottom and the advert in the middle. Now the advert stretches all the way from the top to bottom. And then the third size would be everything right on top of each other.